Well, it's the end of term, and I can't believe that it was only three months ago that I was stood on the forecourt welcoming people to college and talking to a lot of nervous, anxious, uncertain people, and that was just the parents who were dropping students off. Now our students have had a chance to form their friendship groups, to get to know one another and to start to feel at home in college. I've been really fortunate to meet a lot of you during the Principal's Drinks events that we have on Monday evenings here. If you haven't had an invitation to one of those yet, your invitation should be coming next term. And it's been great to see our returners coming back to college, our second, third and fourth year undergraduates who are really helping the college now to emerge from COVID by stepping up into leadership roles on the JCR Executive Committee, as presidents and officers of clubs and societies, and starting new initiatives in college, like the jam sessions that we've been having in the bar over the last few weeks, which have really been a lovely opportunity for our community to come together and listen to some very talented musicians doing their thing. Of course, it hasn't always been easy for everybody, and we've been able to offer support to lots of students this term where they've had any kind of difficulties in their studies or in their personal lives. If you need support, you're very welcome to come and talk to us at any time. The best way to get in touch is by emailing our student support email address or just calling in for a chat with our assistant principal, Debs Monk. So as term draws to a close, we start celebrating Christmas early here at Van Milder. We have to because our students go out of residence at the end of this week. And so we are in the Christmas mood already. And we've already had our Christmas carol service, which was very well attended. Carols by candlelight was a lovely occasion. Our Christmas panto, entirely written and performed by our students. And Christmas Jumper Day is this week as well. So we're very much in the Christmas spirit and that's helped by the Christmas music which has been playing in our dining hall every day for some time now and which is either delightfully seasonal or just a little bit annoying depending on your perspective. But as this term draws to a close, we're also looking ahead, planning for next term when we have lots of things that we want to do. We hope to go back to a more normal schedule of formal dining here in college next term and it'll be really nice to see that Mildred tradition re-established. Our Dimensions programme is really going to ramp up next term, giving you opportunities to broaden your intellectual horizons, to think about your future career and to look after your own health and well-being. Our Humans of Van Milder project is going to roll out, identifying, amplifying and celebrating the wide variety of different people here in our community. And so look out for that in the foyer. And we have a number of student-led initiatives coming up as well next term. The fashion show is next term. The outreach projects will really get going next term with the uh, Young Persons Project Residential at Easter. And uh, we have a number of bops and events and campaigns lined up as well. Christmas is traditionally a time of hope, where we look for light in the darkness. There are lots of reasons to say that we live in dark times at the moment. But the people that I meet every day here at Van Mildert give me tremendous hope and optimism about the future. I hope that this Christmas season will be uh, a period of joy and peace for you, of rest and relaxation, and that you'll return to college in the new year refreshed and ready to resume with renewed energy your studies, your extracurricular activities and your parts in college life. Have a great Christmas. Thanks very much. <laughs>